Check my clock, I can't stop. Fuck around, make my 40 pop. No pop kind, I pop pistols. What it do YouTube, my name is Bear Witness. welcome back to the channel. Now in today's video, we're gonna be talking about the BO4 blackout update that actually happened today. It was actually kind of a bigger update to kind of prepare us for what's gonna be happening tomorrow, um, you know, with the initial specialist, the new maps coming, everything, but there's more about that in my previous videos, but today we're gonna be talking about blackout because it got a massive, massive load of updates and almost kind of like a complete meta change if you guys really think about it like that. Now, one of the cool things about today was not only did it get updated, but they added two of the new weapons that are going to be coming into the game tomorrow into Blackout today. So I have some gameplay on some of those weapons. The AR guy is absolutely sick, but we'll talk about that a little bit more in a minute. First things first, guys, you can notice that the map changes as we play through this video. You guys are going to see some of the map changes, um, which is a general, like, more color. It has a lot more color, and it's very vibrant. And I think that's nice, because when Call of Duty games come out, they generally have a lot of grays. So as a content creator, some of that looks dull to me, so I usually add some color correction. Uh, but to see more vibrant colors to see more more like eye-catching colors I think that's actually pretty dope and it's added a good feel to the map And I hope they kind of keep the vibrant colors even if they change it to a different s Setting later on like I don't know if they're gonna do spring or if they're gonna do actual snow around Christmas But things like that now aside from that guys I want to talk to you guys about the armor repair system, but um, I wanted to show off one of the weapons first, which is the SMG, the Daemon. I, there's some other no, no, uh, like letters and stuff in there, but I'm just going to call it the Daemon. Anyways, the Daemon is a three-round burst submachine gun. I don't think that was accurately portrayed, or maybe I just overlooked it when I was doing the trailer breakdown. But yeah, it is a three-round burst. It's not my preferred. In fact, I feel like it's a little underpowered, so they might need to buff that. Hopefully, they... Uh, they noticed that early on hopefully we can get enough feedback to them and they can possibly buff it you know sometime later next week or this week coming up or something like that but uh you know this is from a blackout since you know there's a lot more armor a lot more health and stuff like that so you know things like that kind of you know weigh into the situation and so it could be a lot easier to use inside of a multiplayer setting but what we're going to talk about is the SWAT I think it's the SWAT RFB or something like that this gun is absolutely phenomenal it's got barely any recoil it has a very noticeable damage drop off you guys might see that I, I don't know I'm not going to pinpoint it but you guys will see somewhere in this gameplay where I try to shoot somebody at a distance and it's it's got this weird bounce and it's also got a, uh, a very very low damage anyways but aside from that it is a good medium to close range weapon and it absolutely has like no recoil in those ranges it's more like a submachine gun ar hybrid in my opinion but that's just my opinion on the situation but when it comes from me i personally very much enjoy this weapon i actually had a lot of fun playing with it and i had a lot of fun trying to get it now um, if you guys want to have access to these weapons or you guys want to find these weapons a lot easier um, They already said in their blog post a couple of days ago that if you're trying to try it out today Then you guys can have you guys can go to firing range and they spawn a little bit more frequently there So but the update comes out tomorrow So we won't have to worry about that very much and you guys will be able to experience it in a multiplayer setting and it's and and you know in the regular game now throughout this gameplay that you're watching you guys will see me doing the armor repair quite a bit now the thing is, is I want to talk to you guys about this first things first the cool thing about this armor repair system is one the fact that when you pick up armor plates which you can find inside of bags inside of chests inside of anything if you guys find armor plates you can immediately equip those armor plates and they act as armor now if you find an actual armor piece you can then if, if they work in slots or segments so you'll see that some pieces of armor i think the level one has five and i think the level two has like seven and i think the level three has like nine i'm not sure if that's accurate but the point is there is a segment and every time somebody shoots you i think each bullet takes out a segment therefore not only do you know how many bullets you could take so i think that's pretty cool but you're able to kind of every time that you pick up a armor repair piece or an armor segment you're able to immediately put that on and repair your armor now this is really cool but i noticed that during my fight not only did the armor seem to be tankier but the fact like level three armor is not easily destroyed like legitimately i noticed that very very quickly as of this update level three armor went from being 
broken in the beta to the point where everybody was like, please nerf it, to here where like where our uh, the, another a day ago to where it was like a graham cracker and the Spitfire absolutely demolished it to oh hey this is actually like I I I personally believe it's manageable. Now, I don't know how the community is going to go about it, but I definitely think it's a manageable type thing. I definitely think it's cool that they rewarded you for having armor and taking care of your armor. It's going to be a really cool feature of the game, but like that's what I mean by it's kind of meta-changing. Because, you know, just because you feel like you have enough bullets into somebody, you have to be careful on how, many, how you push them because of the fact that they can repair their armor. Now... The thing is, when it comes to armor repair, you guys will notice um, that it takes a good three to five seconds. I haven't pinpointed the actual time. And that's, yeah, it only does one segment at a time. It's not like how a trauma kit, if you pop it at like 20 health, it immediately puts you back to 200. It only does one segment at a time, and there is no upgraded version at the current time. So be careful when you guys are using this. Make sure you guys are in a good spot to be using it. That's kind of their way of like not making it broken in a sense but we still haven't been able to play test it enough to see if it is broken so we don't actually know about that yet but aside from that guys uh oh one more thing the audio i i made a everything wrong with blackout video and um you know the community and everybody has been saying for weeks months now that the audio in this game is absolutely terrible and i the one of the most immediate things that i noticed in this update was that the audio had gotten fixed it is actually very useful almost to a fault actually you know i can hear i noticed that i can actually hear people you know in another building like uh, you know i was in firing range so it's not a big area anyways but i can hear people in another building and was immediately able to take advantage of that so i don't know i don't know if it's going to be something that's well embraced by the community or not but it's i'm i'm very happy that they had listened to the community so much now it took them some time we can cut down the time that you listen to the community that's awesome but to be heard by a company that's absolutely amazing and it's something that you don't get from every AAA company especially from AAA companies but with that being said thank you guys for checking out this video i hope you guys enjoyed it as much as i did making it if you guys enjoyed the video make sure you guys click that like button and that bell to be notified on all of my content and i will see you guys tomorrow peace